So let's, let's meet our third participant in our first ever Human Lab Soap Star Edition. Check him out. Okay, I'm coming. For the last six years, fans of One Life to Live have enjoyed John Paul of Lassier as the steamer Rex Balsam. Can we drop this, please? I own a nightclub, and I'm a private investigator, and I just sleep with my ex-mother-in-law, uh, and now I'm a little better. He's a charmer who has a way with the licky. I, I've kissed more people here than I have in my real life. Yes, I've kissed a lot of people on this show. About a dozen. If you're wondering how JP's breath is when he's doing all that kissing, well, why not ask some of his co-stars? Hi, Dorian. What's cooking? I've only kissed him one time in a flashback. This is true. It was fine, though. It was fine. Um, you know, it's 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 pleasant. I get coffee breath sometimes. What? Her breath smells like a bed of roses, just like my love for her. That was the right answer. Let me go with subtext. Keeping a fresh breath is very important. Watch that mouth. Those always tell me I have a sixth sense about it. Yeah, but do you have a mouthwash that lasts 24 hours? I thought not. That's why we're sending you over a product that claims to last the entire day and night. 24 hours. 24 hours. It's alcohol free. It's clinically proven. With pink ion technology. That's probably the key ingredient there. And then you repeat rinsing every morning and night or every 12 hours. Oh, wow. We were all talking, watching your piece. That there isn't anybody who couldn't use this if it actually works. Because I need like gallons of coffee a day. Right. Yes. Yeah, so I always right. have coffee breath or garlic, you know, running through you my veins. You do right now. I, well, thanks but, a lot. Not, not, not. I really appreciate that, no JP. Problem. Good morning. Good morning. How you doing? Great. Now, you know, a lot of people ask celebrities, especially the fellows that get a lot of ladies at work. Oh, is it tough doing all those love scenes? Is it nerve-wracking? Or, you know, and some guys say. It's great, and some people really do say it's awkward. How is it for you? Honestly, you know, once you get past the initial, if you have to kiss somebody for the first time, once you get past that first kiss, then it's mm -hmm. like, you know, smooth sailing for the rest of you know, that first, you know. Business that, as usual. Business as usual. The hard, I think the hardest part about kissing somebody is leaving the, uh, what we say, the tongue at the deli, which means you leave your tongue in your mouth. <laughs> That's the hardest part. It's Especially hard when you're kissing for like three minutes, it can be hard. You have a hard time, so we have to have a kissing. Scene. <laughs> you better work on that, kids. For three minutes. Yeah, they'll okay. they'll be working on that over the break, and when we come back, our first edition of Human Lab Soap Star. Um, well, they'll tell us what what worked and what didn't, what was all washed up. <laughs> <laughs> edition with our soap stars here. This is our first ever edition of our Human Lab Soap Star. So we have three special soap stars. Um, test drive three different products. Yes. Let's see what happened when they put the products to the test. Watch this. Our three soap stars, Rebecca Buttig, Nadia Bjorlund, and John Paul Lavoisier, each agreed to try out a product that promises to help make their daily lives a little easier. Steaming Rex Balsam gets to kiss lots of ladies on One Life to Live, but John Paul Lavoisier doesn't want his character getting a bad rep, a bad breath. So keeping a fresh breath is very important. Co-stars Farrah Fath and Melissa Fumero helped JP mix up a batch of Smart Mouth mouthwash. It's supposed to last 24 hours, all day, all night. Ready? Rinse immediately and vigorously for 30 to 60 seconds. Four. And gargle. Oh, jeez. Go, go. 30 to 60 seconds. That's a long time. Mm hmm That's nice. That's pleasant. <laughs> Thanks. Is it good? It's yeah. good. All right. Bring it on. Oh, another cliffhanger. Turn that button. All right, so let's start out with Rebecca. Rebecca, you say these 
puppies work. Yeah, they keep I like your dogs from screaming. They, they do, and I actually really like them. I have them in right now. Do you um, really? I do. I do. The only, I think, to the only drawback is that my feet sweat a little more. Uh, the, but the trade-off is, is worth it. So you think it's training your foot to just distribute your weight differently on the balls of your feet? I think so. It just makes them more comfortable. If, if heels can be comfortable, I think these, <laughs> these are helpful. Fair, they yeah. really are. So, you know, I'm going to do it because I want to save my feet. I don't want to have foot All right. So you still need the thumbs up. Nadia, you were very brave. You got into the shower for Yes, yeah, so I got a little carried away. <laughs> Thank you. So, but uh, did it did it work out for you? Uh, yeah, it did. It actually smells really nice. It smells like rose water. Um, but I definitely wouldn't recommend it in the shower. I did get a little carried away. But it, it you know what? It's great when you're traveling. It'd probably be great for camping. They smell you like could probably you could probably really put nice. it in like a lingerie drawer or something too. I, I think thinking. you could totally use that on your face yeah. too. Do you want to smell some roses? Too? <laughs> <laughs> it's like y'all whatever. Yeah. It's fun being the only guy at the table. This is so fascinating. <laughs> Keep talking. All right, well, now we're up to you. So uh, that was a bit of a cliffhanger. Did the mouthwash work or not? Um, it didn't burn like most, most mouthwash. Uh -huh. And something I thought of, I surprised myself, it's very sanitary because it's a pump, so you can share it. Oh. You don't have to worry about, like, here's my mouthwash. Right. So you just little... squirt it. So that's, that's a very so that good point. See that? You know, uh, we wanted you to be able to, you know, really put it to the test. So we thought it, it, it might be fun to, to welcome your, your co-star, Farrah. Farrah Path out here. So. <laughs> You know, I don't get to watch a lot of daytime because, hello, I'm working just like you are. So, you know, we thought it might be fun for you to, you know, give it a little spin here. Oh. All right. yeah. um, we're going to let them make out and watch. Good, huh? Oh. Breath. You know, I thought it was not to kiss the breath. Pretty flawless, your breath. Oh goodness. Fun she does, so fun something to make out with. Um, we'll be right back. Tomorrow, we're going back to the.